All right, ladies and gentlemen, this time, this Fly Right Boy exclusive is going to be brought to you by Gorilla Glue. That's right, Gorilla Glue. Anyway, so, <clears throat> uh, if y'all seen any of our videos, y'all know that the 22 Raptor had an unfortunate accident where it went down very hard and very fast. So, the whole front end from here to the front was gone. There's a bunch of pieces, very, very small pieces. <clears throat> so this is what exactly what I've done. Uh, well, we all know that the Twin Two Raptor nose cone was made out of plastic. That was gone. So I'm using foam board. <clears throat> and I've shaped the foam board, took off the paper, so it was just the foam, and cut it into a heart shape. Not a cone or a triangle, but a heart. Because it needed to actually have some kind of... Uh, oval almost but triangle <clears throat> so I painted it with the grill glue I hot glued it on then I painted it with the griddle glue I also did the sides here I've already sanded them down um, somewhat smooth uh, if you want it to be picture perfect like it was when you first got the plane I would suggest you sand it down but the thing is the foam is going to have a lot of pores in it because uh, it's not going to be completely solid so what you're going to have to do is you can redo it again, the where the spots that have the little divots in it, and then sand it, and then redo it again and sand it. So it's going to probably be a process of maybe three or four times till you get it to the point where it's completely smooth. Then you can put uh, some prime paint on it and then paint it back. <clears throat> but for me right now, I just want to get the shape back of the plane and then get it up back up in the air. My first attempt to fly the plane this last Saturday, uh, I actually put duct tape, which was too heavy, and I was way too nose heavy, and, and I couldn't even get the plane off the ground. But as you can see, she's has the original F-22 shape now, and it's a little rough, but it's a lot better than it was. A lot, lot better. If you can kind of tell that there's some blue, that's because, like I said before, there was pieces where... There was no foam at all, like big gaps. So if I put the glue on, it would just fall through. So what I had to do was I used the blue tape in those spots, and then when the foam um, went on top, it actually just you know made the shape again. <clears throat> so it's coming together. It definitely is coming together. These little gaps, these are or the, uh, the foam board. Dollar Tree foam board, and I basically just cut them out and then pasted them, uh, hot glue them on, so that that way you know the plane still has its shape. After I'm done, you probably won't even be able to tell uh, that this plane ever crashed, and it's coming along, it's coming along. All right, this is another Fly Right Boy exclusive. Uh, just kind of giving y'all a heads up. Uh, what I'm doing right now, working on. Uh, please like our page. Uh, you, we have Chad, Jay Chaz, uh, Blair Davis, and Kevin Peavy uh, for Facebook pages. We are the Fly Right Boys. We fly right or we go home. All right, that would be a cut, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much. I appreciate y'all looking at the video, and y'all have a good and happy, safe New Year. Bye.